This is, I believe, the 25 or the 26 one. I don't know. But, uh, you've seen in my previous vlog, which wasn't a transgender vlog, and this one kind of is and kind of isn't. I've, uh, been uh, trying to come to terms with with me. Um, it's not, it's not a good thing. I, uh, I have issues that I don't think I'll ever be able to change. I mean, I'm a girl, I know nothing will change that, and I can change my body, I can always implant bigger breasts if I need to, I can remove fat off my stomach, I can finally feel whole with surgery, but there's there's other things I'll never be able to change. And one of them is being autistic. Uh, this is going to be a little bit self-hating in this point, but I really, really hate I'm autistic. High functioning autism, but sometimes it feels like I'm not simply because I'm just not really good at things. I mean, partly I lack mo I, l I lack motivation because I was just so bad at everything when I was young that I feel like I'm going to fail everything now. And of course, the autistic drive makes me want to do everything perfect, so I don't ask for help, and even when I do, it feels like it's just pity. And I hate being pitied. Just ignore the obvious hypocrisy that is me making a vlog about it. But it's this, it's this drive to know that I have to be perfect, I can't miss a single step, I can't do anything wrong because if I do, I'll go back to square one and when I do do something wrong, I start mulling over it, I start being paranoid, I start not wanting to do that thing again and it's not been a fun time I So as you all know, Thursday, a week ago, Esther fucked up. I'm going to be checking my Esther every week now. I'm going to be paranoid for the rest of my life that I can never screw up again. That I'm that next time I go to BabsCon, I'm going to be just so fucked in the head that I will just. I don't enjoy being autistic. It's ruin my life and my social interactions with people. I'm I'm slower than others when it comes to social conversations and that's fucked me a couple of times. It fucked me with Dreamcatcher. I love the girl so much, but I just it's difficult. And I'll hate myself so much for not being able to get past it. Like on my current coursework at the moment I my brain is just physically, just physically unable to um, react and understand what my grade sheets want me to do. Like everybody else is going on fine, and I'm and I'm and I'm and I'm and I'm just sitting there like I'm trying so hard to understand, and I can't. It's 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 the same thing with my fan fiction writing. I'm writing things like it's a fucking stage direction and not a story. And for the life of me, I just can't get past it. And I would like to just have like a machine just take the autism out of me so I can be something that isn't a subpar person. Because that's what it feels like. It feels like I'm half a person. Like, my mum's got autism. She... She's not particularly bright. She's not very good at anything she does. And I am terrified I'm going to end up like that. 
I'm, I'm terrified I'm going to end up obsessed with making everything perfect in the life it is. I'm terrified that I'm going to be obsessed with just having control over others. Just making everything bland and white and everything. It's not fun at all. I mean, so far the only thing I'm good at seems to be petting cats and dogs and streaming Armored Warfare. And even then, when I get a bad game on AW, when I get a bad string of games, I start to really beat myself up. You should have seen it last stream, I was fucking terrible. <laughs> just... Okay. I have an exam in a week and I actually haven't studied for it because I've been just so... I want to say procrastinating, but kind of not. I don't I don't know, but... It's mostly multiple choice, so I've got like a 25% like chance of getting everything right, which is okay as far as I'm concerned. I'm just going to have to wait, study and see and hope it all goes well. I'm going to try talking to some of the people that I fucked things up with during BabsCon. Just tell them, hey, I I made a mistake and I'm kicking myself for it and I didn't mean what I said. Because that's the thing, like, you want to say something in your head but then your mouth does it differently and then in a, and then in a second you fucked everything up. Like, one of the reasons why I insult people all the time is because I can't actually do anything else. Like, I can't even hold a basic social conversation. It's... it's weird. Oh, well, that's it for now, guys. Just... Yay, autism. So much fun. Love it. <laughs>